Yes. Okay. Let's go for it. So everybody could try it together. We got a new participant and we can see him. His name is Arnav. Arnav, let's see. Let's see. I, don't, I can't see Arnav. Okay. Hi, Arnav. Could you hear us? Hello. We can hear you, but we can hear you very faintly. Your voice is a, a bit low. You can hear us? You can hear me at the moment? Yes. Okay, great. Welcome, Arnav. Arnav, there is a lot of light behind you. So maybe somehow if you can move the positioning, well, if because we can't see you properly. We can just see you that your mom, I think, is there with you trying to sort things out, which is great. Okay. Prabhu? Yes, please, Chris Chaitanya. Is Jay joining in? Jay should be joining in. I hope he does. Yes, yeah, I spoke to his parents yesterday and uh, he loves the sessions, so I would expect him to be here soon. I love it too. You do? Of course, yes. Thanks a lot. Um, because remember last time I tried to write, I love your classes, but I, I love your crosses. Yes, yeah, I was thinking if I'm wearing any t-shirt which says crosses rather than glasses which is great but no that's good that's good to good to know thank you so much Krish and then we, we really like your presence as well you are always there so somebody could uh, reply back to adi because Ro rohan wouldn't dare to do that 
and Aaron is not bothered, it seems. <laughs> okay. All right. Hurry, ball. So let me share the slides now. What we try to do is try to. Okay. So just. Uh -huh. Yes, please. Um, um, you know, um, when like when we do the, when we're like doing all the writing, like when 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 you share the screen and everything, yes. and like why did these um gray gray blocks come in? Okay, what happens if I if I'm okay? I can't show you my screen, but if I'm sharing one screen and on the top of that, if I will open another screen. So for example. At the moment, I'm sharing the prayer screens. But as soon as I will open another slide, which I'm going to share you, during that transition, you can see the new screen as the gray because I haven't shared that. It should not happen, and I'm sure WebEx will. Oh, Prabhu. Yes. I know. I know why the new person. Um, you know the person that like it kind of his name is kind of like Jay. Yes. And um, I know why you, his voice is really low. Why? Because on his headphones, he's supposed to pull that little thing down so you can talk. Oh, yes. Very nice observation. Christian Chaitanya. Arnav, could I please request you? I think your mouthpiece on the left hand side is on the top. Could you please bring it down? Okay, Arnav, we cannot hear you. Can you hear us? Yes. Okay, Arnav, your voice is very thin. The reason being, you are on headphone, and with the headphone, there's a mouthpiece, which is on the top. If you can slide it down on the left, bring it down, it will be great. On the other side. On the other so side, which I so believe. It your That's mouth. it. Now, if you say Hare Krishna, please. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Very nice. Very nice. So good to have you, Arnav. And thank you so much, Krishna Chaitanya. Your observation is so, so, so good. And we all are getting benefit out of it. Okay. Nice. Arnav, it's so good to have you here. What we are doing? Do you know about Bhagavad Gita, Arnav? No. No? Okay, no worries. Ad Would you like to tell something to... Okay, I'm checking. Okay, Rohan is here. Welcome, Rohan. Krishna. Adi, would you like to tell something about Bhagavad Gita to Arnav? Arnav doesn't know. Adi, you are on mute. Let me unmute you. Okay, you are unmute. Go for it, please. So, so Adi was telling Krishna, um, he... he he first place he wanted to um, um fight, but now he didn't because he saw his all um friends, family, um teachers. So he didn't want to die. He gave five things. Krishna, what? Why not? Yes, very nice. And Prabhu, I've yes, got one. Please. Yes, go for. And like Bhagavad Gita also teaches you like in like. If like someone dies or you have to kill them, it's for a specific reason. Like you shouldn't get sad that they're gonna die or anything because they're gonna die, but the soul inside them will never die. Yes. And if you be good, the soul mm -hmm. will go to Krishna. If you be bad, it will also go to Krishna. But you just it just won't you'll just get sent back to earth. That's very nice. Yes. That soul will go into a new body that will come onto earth. Yes. And uh, thank you, Krishna Chaitanya. Yes, that's very correct. So, Arnav, I hope you are learning a bit. And uh, this is what we do. We do the discussions and we read a bit from the screen. I hope you can see the screen. And uh, we cannot see Rohan. So just to check if Rohan is still there. Rohan, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, thank you. Rohan, could you please uh, let Arnav know that what is Bhagavad Gita. So Adi and Krishna Chaitanya told him that why, Krish, why Bhagavad Gita is good to know. What is Bhagavad Gita? If we need to tell somebody who doesn't even know what Bhagavad Gita is, what is this Bhagavad Gita? Um, the Bhagavad Gita contains 700 shlokas and yes. is told by Krishna to Arjun on 
the battlefield of a war I can't really remember. Um, Very nice. No, I think I think Justin had just to, uh, that's perfect. So if I need to tell somebody who doesn't know anything about Bhagavad Gita, and I have met many adults in my life, they don't know about Bhagavad Gita. Reason being, they are not spiritual, they are not Krishna conscious, and uh, they they don't know much about India. So they don't know anything about Bhagavad Gita. There are many. So usually what I say that yes, Bhagavad Gita is one of the holy book. And because most of the religions, they have holy book. Prabhu? Yes, Krishna Chaitanya. Do you dis... Do you like... You know, like... I can't see, but... Do you like... You know when people like give you books and then you go out and you like talk about it and you... Like, do you yes. do you do that? Yes, we have done it. Arin has done it in Paris. We were there in Paris. I have done it. Paris? Yes, we were in Paris. And uh, I have done it in London as well. When you go out and you do the book distribution. Yeah. And, uh, you can do it anytime. But in December, it's the best time to do it. Bef Why? Before the new year. Because December, in every December, roughly in the middle, we have Gita Jayanti. Anybody knows this word, Jayanti? It's a Hindi word, could be Sanskrit. But this word means when Jay, so Jayanti, Jan, birth. That's when Krish, Krishna gave. So many years back, roughly, do we know roughly how many years back Krishna told Arjuna? Yes, it's 5,000. And this is roughly. So like if somebody will ask uh, next year, how many years roughly? We will say 5,000. If somebody would ask or would have asked last year, then also we would have said 5,000. So roughly 5,000 years back, Krishna gave Bhagavad Gita to Arjuna. Now when we said Krishna gave, now that doesn't mean that Krishna gave one of those books. No, it, it was a dialogue. It was a conversation. So this is the first thing we usually say that. Okay, somebody. Okay, Rohan is to join from two places. Oh, this is nice. He's enjoying so much. He would like to join from two places, which is great. What, is, what, what do you mean, Prabhu? So we're going to hear echoing. So I think yeah. we should take one of them out. One of no, no, no. Maybe he's testing. No. I think, uh, yeah, sometimes it happens. For example, I connect it from my laptop, then I connect from my mobile for some reason. So Rohan is doing some testing, which is great. We should always keep trying, keep learning new things. So that's good. So Bhagavad Gita is a conversation between Krishna and Arjuna. Krishna is the teacher, Arjun is the student. And Arjun, all those learnings which Arjun got, Arjun got it for us. Right. It says, it's like, if Krishna is the cow... Jay is joining in. Jay has joined in. Hi, We were waiting for Jay. And because Jay is here... Who, where is Jay? He went away. He went away. I think we scared him. I thought somebody, somebody tripped away. Yeah. Oh, I think it was Adi. As soon as Jay saw Adi, Jay ran away. <laughs> okay, I'm sure he will come back. Okay, so great. So, Arnav, could you please remind us? Okay, Arnav's mom is checking. How are you doing? Arnav, could you please remind us that uh, which class are you in? My class is class one. Class one. You are in year one. Wow. Fantastic. Adi, could you please remind us which class you are in? Uh, year two. Year two, right. Because this is what I was thinking, that so far, Adi was our youngest member. But now, we got Arnav, who is even younger. So, Adi, you got the responsibility now. Okay. Uh, Prabhu, yeah. I'll, I'll take care of her. Prabhu. Okay, yes. Yes, please. You know something? I'm yeah. eight and I'm in class two. Okay. Well, that's okay. It has. Hey. Yeah. 
Well, diff- yeah, we are in different, like, Shivan. It's because, because my school, you need to start P1 when you're six. Okay. All right, all right. yeah. That's, that's good. It's okay. Everybody got a different uh, journey. Okay, so, Jay is here. Jay, Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare boy. <laughs> okay, we were waiting for Jay. Jay, we were missing you so much. Krishna Chaitanya and Adi, they didn't let us go any further. They said, wait for Jay, wait. Jay is coming. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. yeah. All right. Okay, let's go for it. So, so what did we... Sorry, I'm a little bit late. Okay, no worries. <laughs> Prabhu? Yes, please, Krishna Chaitanya. Can can I do can I do nursing with Devar? Okay, let let. Me... Okay. Bring it on the screen. Okay, so then we can do the nursing arti. It's very nice. Okay, uh, while I'm taking this out, anybody would like to explain to uh, that what is nursing Dave arti or who is nursing Dave? I'll let Jay do it. Okay, Jay. So, Narasimha no, Dev is a form of Krishna that came to save that that uh, came to save Pralad Maharaj because of that because Pralad Maharaj's father said that he was God and he was trying to kill kill Pralad and Pralad said that you are not God. So then Krishna in the form of nursing a day. Aribo, very nice. Let's start. Yes. Arnav, let you, uh, Krishna Chaitanya, sorry, just to let uh, Arnav know. Arnav, if you can see the screen, then we are going to sing this. And Krishna Chaitanya is our leader at the moment. So he's going to read one line and we are going to read after him. Okay, and then we will move forward. Yes, please. Should I, should I play my cartons? Oh, that would be brilliant. Krishna Chaitanya, are you good? Shall uh, Jay play the kirtan for you? Yeah, sure. Yes, great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I'll just get him. Sure. Let's wait. Jay is bringing the character. Let you know. Just here. Yeah, wash your hands and get it. Thank you. All right. Here we go. I think we are ready. Yes. Okay, Chris Chaitanya. It's over to you now, please. Namaste. Not a singer. Namaste, not a singer. The Lord, the Lord, the Lord, the Hiranya <laughs> Shahari, 
जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे केशव जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे जय नरसिंह देव जय नरसिंह देव जय नरसिंह देव जय नरसिंह देव जय नरसिंह महादेव जय नरसिंह महादेव जय महादेव जय नरसिंह महादेव जय प्रहलाद नरसिंह 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 जय लक्ष्मी 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 नरसिंह जय जय प्रभु पाद प्रभु पाद प्रभु जय जय प्रभु पाद जय जय प्रभु पाद प्रभु जय जय प्रभु जय गुरु जय गुरु जय गुरु जय गुरु जय गुरु देवा जय गुरु देवा जय गुरु देवा जय गुरु देवा नित्य गौर हरि बोल नित्य गौर हरि बोल नित्य गौर हरि बोल नित्य गौर हरि हरी गौर हरि बो हरि बो हरि बो नीता गौर हरि बो हरि बो हरि बो नीता गौर हरि बो हरि बो हरि बो नीता गौर हरि बो हरि हरि बो हरि बो की जय जय कृष्ण चैतन्य दैट वाज सो सो नाइस वी ऑल थोरली एंजॉयड इट थैंक यू सो मच सो आई डोंट नो इफ इट माइट बी वेरी न्यू फॉर यू सो यू माइट हैवेंट हर्ड दैट बिफोर राइट इट कुड बी दैट दिस इज द वेरी फर्स्ट टाइम यू हर्ड अबाउट इट बट इट्स ओके बिकॉज़ इट वाज फर्स्ट टाइम फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस right there was a time when we didn't know about it and uh, we got to know about it and we really enjoyed after that okay so let me what will do okay i'm going to share another screen now for presentation slides and we will go through from there but what did we do yesterday after i left because i had to leave and then somebody else was there with you what did you do it during that time oh he was just showing us slides and then we did quizzes all right but what was there in those was something interesting it was something about bhakti nine uh, forms of bhakti i don't know something like that and we did a little verse yes was it anything interesting you did no well it was okay it was okay okay that ooh just just i'm a bit more like a bit more used to you oh yes of course yeah we we get used to of things very soon things and people but remember we we accept krishna we don't need to get attached to anything i'm i'm mm. one of those uh, but there will be more which you will get uh, in your life and just learn and then move on right it's not container it's the content so let me tell you a very quick story a real story about uh, a rishi his name was uh, ashtavakra anybody has heard of his name ashtavakra no i'm not sure okay 
Anybody know what ashed means? Ashed. In counting. Okay, not Aryan because he has heard it from me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Give a guess. Out of these numbers, ashed means 1. Yeah. What you are about to guess then? Yes. So ashed means... Yes. So ashed means 8. Now after the class, what you can do, you can ask your parents. And they should... Right? If they would not know, then you can teach them. And if they know, then they will be so happy that you know now. Right? Babu? Yes, please, Krishna Chaitanya. I have a question about yes, like, please. like it's so, you know, my mom says instruments, they have yes. like a type of God inside it. That's right. Yes. Question. Um, like, can you, if you, you don't have to, but if you can, can you show me a picture of that God? Picture of that God? When yeah. You, no, the way, see, God is Krishna, right? No, it, I know God. See, Krishna's made a lot of demigods and stuff, right? Yes. yes. Do you, like, do you have a picture on Google of the God that, like, lives in instruments? No, but, for example, the way Krishna looks like, People, the it, description is given like of his color, but then there are different ones. Similarly, for all the demigods, there are different faces, right? So, for example, we have Mridang. You might able to see, can you, where we are? Okay, you can see. I really wanted a Mridang. Yes, we got the Mridang in orange at the back. Can you see that? Yes. Yes, that's Mridang. Now, Mridang is supposed to be the expansion of Balramji. Fluid. Flute. Which Krishna used to uh, play. That's, that's Balramji. So, everything is expansion. So, it's hard to find out a picture and we say, this is Balram and this is Krishna. But, if you will see somebody blue, if you see a feather, peacock feather in the head. Yes. Um, you, well, I, I've got a, I've got drums and guitar. Very nice. So maybe. Except my brother, I told this to Aryan in the morning. Uh -huh. Except my brother, my two-year-old brother, yes? broke my guitar. Oh. So I had to borrow a guitar. Okay. Yeah. Little boys, uh, little girls, they do that. And trust us. So Smacked it with a bat, so I have to hide all the bats. Ah, okay, yeah. We need that's to good find thing. the last one. Yes, but trust me, Krishna, Krishna must have inspired your brother to do that. It previous karma. But uh, yes. I'm glad I'm glad it's getting over now. Yes, we are burning our previous karma. So that's good. Now think about this. I was I was telling you a little story about Ashtavakra. Now in Sanskrit, Asht is eight. Right. The counting eight is ashed. Vakra. I thought I thought art. I thought it was. I thought it was art. That art. Was yes. Yes. No. You're right. In Hindi we call it art, but in oh. Sanskrit we call it ashed. Oh. Okay. Yes. So, but you, uh, well, uh, definitely remember this ashed, and you can ask this from your, and they might able to tell you rest of the counting in Hindi or in Sanskrit is very nice. And the Vakra. There is the next word in this name is Vakra. Anybody would like to make a guess? Do you know? No. Ashta. Yeah. Okay, no. Ashta. Yeah. Do Ash mean what? Twist. Yes. So Ashta Vakra. Vakra means bent. So somebody who is bent from Eight places is called Akshat Vakra. Right, Arnav? Somebody, so there was a person who was bent from eight places and that's why he was called Akshat Vakra. Right, can you imagine? Can you imagine somebody who is bent from eight places? Have you seen people who are bent from eight places? Uh, what do you mean? I think it's Rohit because... Um... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, that one. All right. What do you mean? 
Okay, I'll, I'm oh. going to show you a picture. And then that picture. My. Okay, let's see this picture. Okay, I'm going to share something new. Uh, you don't have to do that. Okay. Here. What is a grey screen on that? Uh, yes. Can you see that screen now on the screen? Yes. Yes. Can you see? It says huh? story. Story yeah. behind Ashtavakra Gita. Yeah. Yeah. The person who is standing next to it in the picture, if you see, he's bent. Yes. Yeah, he, he's not straight, he's bent, his bones are bent. For example, my hand is straight, I stand, our legs are straight. So, but some people, they are bent. So he was bent from eight places and that's why he was called Vakra. Now what happened? Remember we heard the story of Janak. There was a king yeah. Janak. Yes? Remember King, king Janak? Adi, do you know who was the daughter of King Janak? Um, Sita. That's nice. Very nice. Very nice. Arnav, do you know Sita? Yes. Very nice. Do you know this husband of Sita? Yes. Wow. Very good. That's good to know. Good to know. So, ha, Sita's father was King Janak. Now, King Janak was a king. So, he had a big palace. So once he was there in the palace and with the, all his ministers and Saint Ashtavakra walked into the palace and everybody started laughing. Why? He, he was not normal. He was bent from eight. Everybody saw him and started laughing at him. We, very, very, very wrong. We should never do that because we should see Krishna in everyone. Right? But when everybody started laughing, what he did? He also started laughing. And then what happened? First thing, that when he started laughing, then people were not laughing at him. People were laughing with him. Right? And then very soon, everybody realized and they stopped. But he was still laughing. So King Janak asked, Why are you laughing? And he said, Well, I'm laughing on your ministers. I thought they are very wise. But when they looked at me, they started laughing. Now tell me this, if I will bring a pot, have you seen a clay pot or think of any metal yeah. pot? Yeah, any container. If, if that pot is bent, are you going to laugh at that pot? Or are you going to laugh at the person who made that, that uh, bent utensil, the pot? If somebody has made like a drawing, if a drawing is funny, are you laughing at the funny drawing or are you laughing at the person who made that drawing funny? If, if, and the picture. Yeah. But if a pot is not made very nice and you're laughing, you're laughing at the person who made it rather than the pot itself. So what he was trying to say that when you're laughing at me, I'm a pot. Krishna made it. So are you laughing at me or are you laughing at Krishna who made me? And everybody realized, oh, he's a very wise. He, he is very wise. So whenever we see somebody, and if you... Prabhu? Yes, Krishna Chaitanya. Is it hard to live with bending things? It's very hard to live, but only when you will think. Because we, we do the comparisons between straight and... But somebody is bent, then that person will not think that way. Are different. For example, I wear specs, and without specs, I cannot tell from the camera that who is Krishna Chaitanya and who is Adi. For real. For real. You know why? Because when I was a child, I was very naughty. When I'm still naughty, but when I was a child, I used to watch a lot of televisions, and they are not good for your eyes. So today's moral: don't watch too much TV. Don't watch too much. <laughs> Laptops, okay. Don't spend hours and hours. Well, if you are playing chess, that's a different thing. But don't do a lot of them. So remember this. Ashtavakra, somebody who is bent from eight places. If he's, he's there, if he's going, somebody is going to laugh at him, the person is not laughing at him. The person is laughing at Krishna who made it. So the story comes where it says, 
container and the content. For example, somebody will bring, your mom or dad will bring you a glass of milk, right? And you will say, no, 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 I don't want in this glass, I want in my blue glass. Or if Shivani will be here, I'm missing Mana now, Mana is not here. The girls might say, oh, I want, I want this milk in my pink container, my pink cup, my pink mug, or my glittery mug, you know, my favorite mug. Now the thing is, it's not the container which is important. It's the content which is inside the container which is important, right? So, if as a teacher, I'm telling you something, I am not that important. But what I'm telling you is more important. So, whether I'm telling you or somebody else telling you, what's important is the content, the knowledge, the wisdom you are getting. Okay, so always remember that. So, Arnav, you learned few stories today. You learned about the content and container. Tell this to your mom and ask her if she knows about Ashtavakra and King Janak. These are the stories. You remember what's the best way of remembering a story? Adi, do you know? No. Um, put it in your mind or in the camera. Or yes, that's a, that's a good one. That's, that's the way we do the practice. But the best way to remember is tell somebody else. As soon as you will learn something, if you want to keep reminding yourself, you can, as Adi said, you can stand at the front of mirror and you can tell the story to yourself. <laughs> oh, how about this? If you go to your mom, if you go to your dad, if you go to your granny, gran to anyone. grandmother or grandfather, if you Whoever. nearby, whenever you speak to them, tell them those stories you have learned and you will be amazed. Well, they will be so happy that you have told them the stories and this way you will remember. Okay. All right. I'm going to take this picture away and we will come back to our slides. Okay. Can, can we see text 34? Yeah. Yes. Great. Arnav, can you see the slide? Arnav? Mm, yes. Yes, can you, can you read this slide, please, where it says, okay, uh, okay, Arnav, I'm going to read it for you, okay, because this is your first session. It says, regulated sense gratification. Now, remember, sense gratification will be used later, SG. And then it says, sense control versus sense denial. Now, what does that mean? That's confusing. Who would like to say? Jay? Prabhu? Yes, Chris. Yeah. Why is there a sheep or a lamb there? Yes, yes. Let's see if Jay would like to tell us something. Okay, you wait. Jay, yeah. would you like to say something, please? What, what does this uh, sense control versus sense denial mean? What are we trying to say here? So, I'm not sure. Like, no worries. Anything. And Aaron would like to add. Okay, while you think, if, Jay, let's see what Aaron would like to say. Yeah? Is, is the sheep there and because it's eating? Is it because it's controlled? Or it's, um, no, it's, it's having sense of denial? And then if it doesn't eat too much, it says control? It's mm -hmm. controlling its sense of how much it should eat? Yeah. Nice. Yes. It's a, it's a pure... Yes. Yes, that's right. So, that's why we got sheep there. If you will see, you know, sheep doesn't have control on the senses, which means sheep loves the grass. For example, Arnav, what's your favorite food? What your mom cooked? Don't say there is no Sorry, what, what is it? Mango. Mango, wow. Mango. Mango. Yeah, we all love mangoes, don't we? And up um, I have a second favorite. Yes. Are these safe? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's say we got the mango. So, Adi, how many mangoes do you eat? Uh, zero. Zero? 
Why you don't like mangoes? Not really. No. Okay. I love mangoes. Okay, Krish Chaitanya, how many mangoes you can eat? All together. All together in one go. Like in one go. In one go means you will have one, then we will give you second. Oh, oh okay, okay. About like fifteen. Fifteen. Wow, you really <laughs> love mangoes, Rohan. What do you think? How many you will able to eat? Mm, what do you mean, like twenty whole mangoes or like twenty slices? Whole mangoes. So one whole mango, mango, and obviously it could be a small, it could be a big, but one mango we will split into few. But the whole one mango. So how many of so many mangoes you can eat? Twenty or more, at least. Twenty or more. Wow. Yes, yeah, seriously. Wow, we, we're going to have some tough competition here. Jay, what do you think? How many you could eat? In, in 60 seconds, okay. I can eat 20 mangoes. Wow, here we go. As I expected. But if, if you were asking me of a party parade, then I could have a, like, more, like, more than 100 or something. More than 100 Pani Puris. Yeah, I had Pani Puris for dinner yesterday. Okay, nice. Arnav, Arnav, how many, you said mango is your favorite. How many mangoes you can eat? One. One? Okay. <laughs> yeah, after one, if I will give you second one, can you eat that also? Yes. Okay. So... So, Krish, Tanya, and Rohan, you said 15 and 20. Let's say. No, uh, I thought. I thought you meant 15. Like I thought you meant like. I thought you meant like in. I thought you meant like in pieces. If you do, you mean like in mangoes? Mangoes, full mango. Oh, then then I could do like about 20. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Let's say. Let's say you can eat 20. But after 20, if I will give you one more. I mean, if you give me one more, I wouldn't eat the whole thing. I could have half of it. Yes. And let's say if you have eaten half of 21st, if I will give you one more after that. Oh, I'll just have like one slice. Yes. Let's say you got one slide of 22. If I will give you one more after. Okay, then I'll have nothing. Now, Rohan, do you think it, it's the same with you as well? Or will you say, no, I can still eat 21, 22, 23, 24, 25? I would stop at 20. Yes, you will stop at 20. Why? Because this is called sense control. But to be honest, sense control will be that you should control after few. 20, maybe. <laughs> too much. Maybe. But, but well, it, maybe. Maybe. Uh -huh. It depends. Maybe I'm like Maybe I might change so much Pani Puri. If anyone asks me to have four, I would. Yes. But let me tell you something about sheep. Sheep, if you will see, they don't stop. They don't stop. They keep eating. Yeah, they keep having grass. They munch here. They... Where do they keep it in their tummy? Because, well, no, what happens? They have, you know, the wool we get. The clothes yeah. of wool. That wool comes from the sheep. More they eat, more wool they grow. And but sometimes they overgrow themselves. They they don't know. And that's why they are there. They keep eating, keep eating. And a lot of time you will see, especially while watching TV, adults or even kids, but adults are also quite uncontrolled. Sometimes they are there. And they will just start eating, 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 munching, munching, munching. And before they will know, they have finished the whole pack of crisps, whole pack of biscuits, which are which they are not good anyways. But having too much or too many of those control versus sense denial. Denial is when you deny something. You say, that's it. I won't have it. It's bad. So what Krishna is saying, that it's hard. It's very hard to say, no, it's bad. It's no, I'm not going to have it. What's easy is that you control your sense. Actually, something which is even better than that is age. For example, we will say, okay, no watching. Don't watch. But you have eyes. You will watch. You can't have your eyes closed. Well, I can have my specs off. 
but you have to have your eyes open. As soon as your eyes are open, you will watch. So, con con so, so first thing is you cannot deny your eyes. Senses. Second thing is you can control what you watch, what you don't watch. But again, that's a bit cumbersome. That's that might be a bit difficult and complicated. What's easy or easier is when you engage your senses, when you make your implicit, intentional, conscious effort, saying that I'm going to watch Little Krishna, I'm going to watch relate to read related to Krishna, Arnav. Heard, yes. Have you heard of Krishna before? Do you know who is Krishna? Yes. Very nice. Have you watched Little Krishna? Yes. Very nice. Very nice. So good to hear. So because Arnav has recently joined us only today itself. So we didn't know about Arnav. So we are just asking. Great. And let's move on to the next one. Adi. Could you please read this slide? Let's see. It's reading a bit hard, so I'm going to increase the font if I can. No, 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 no. You can. Why not? Okay, I do. Okay, I'm just going to increase the size of the font so you can read it better. Adi, you can see the slides? Adi? Adi, we cannot hear you. You are on mute. Let me unmute you. Thank you. You, are... you understand the writing. Okay, yeah. yeah, it's a bit hard to... Okay, let me change the font. <gasps> this is what Aryan put together. He loves trying different things. Okay. How these rules and red solution on hats to them because practice of sense. The race race under red regulations will also be as as much as much as much we will always choose done. <laughs> Thank you, Adi. Very nice. Rohan, would you also like to read this, please? Okay, Rohan is on mute. No worries. I will request Arin. Arin, would you like to read it, yeah, please? Sure. 3.34. One has to follow those rules and regulations and attach to them because practice of sensed gratification under regulations may also lead to one to go astray. As much as there is all, always the chance of an accident, even on the royal roads. Aribu. Yes. So let's say Aryan, Aryan would like to say something. Yes, Ari, what do you understand by this? So I understand that there are rules you have to follow. But if you do it with when you're practicing a um, sense of gratification under the regulations, you might go away. Like on the um, in the previous picture, I'm not really sure. Um, one of them, it was the um no no it was the um so it was about the um there was the five senses as the senses. So it says also lead one to go astray. So if you do both of them together. The horses will go wild and go away. Very nice. And the example is um, that there's a chance of accident even on the royal road. For example, if there's a road in front of the palace, can be a royal road, but you will still have an accident there. Not like um, if it's a royal road, you won't have any accidents. You still have an equal chance. Great. Great. Thank you. So, yes, yeah, this is what it meant, really. That sense gratification is like uh, you can regulate them. So it's not that you just keep eating, keep eating. No, you need to watch what are you eating? How much are you eating? And same thing with all the five senses. Arnav, do you know what are the five senses we have? Like we have ears, nose. Yes. Okay, great. So see, we have five senses. Adi, will you please remind us what are the five senses? Adi, we cannot Adi, hear you. Mute. Let me. Uh, yes, go on now. Smell, yes. Talk, taste, sight, no. Yes. What? Sight. Yes. Krishna Chaitanya, he said 
Sight. What? Yes, very no, 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 sight. sight. So, okay, you're right. Does it say the sixth sense? The sixth sense is also there, which is called intuition. Sense. But sixth sense comes from the experience. It's common sense. You can Six. say common sense, okay. So, what we have five senses, right? We hear, sorry, that's the one. <laughs> See? Behind you, I, I, to I told you I have bad eyesight, don't I? Didn't I tell you that? So, no, from eyes, you watch. From ears, you listen. From nose, you smell. From tongue, you taste. And from skin, you feel. Not only you, I do the same actually. So, and it says skin is the biggest sense organ we have in the body. That's, it's, that's it's all true. around. It's, it's all around. It's the biggest one. So, Okay, we are getting there and we're going to go move move to the next section but uh, but yes so this analogy what it's trying to say that when you tr really try to control the senses then it's hard right it's it's like even when you, uh, but it's better for example when you're driving a car on the road then you need to control yourself what you cannot do keep watching here keep talking here keep listening maybe you have your ipad watching movie playing games well, you can do that when your parents are driving, but you should not do that when you are driving. Okay, so remember that when you will turn 18 and start driving. I don't know. By that time, you might forget me altogether. But it's all tell you. It, it doesn't only matter. I will not. Oh, thank you so much, Krishna Chaitanya. But, you know, time, time. Me too. Okay. Oh, thank you. So, but yeah, even if you forget me, that's okay. But again, I'm, I'm just a container. But the content is Bhagavad Gita at the moment. So don't forget this, that even on, it doesn't matter how much we try to control the senses, they can still go, and the word uses astray, A-S-T-R-A-Y. It's like when a sheep is there, for the, it says, for the grass, sheep or lamb, baby lamb, could go anywhere and might fall off the cliff just because of the senses and it has happened in so this is what we should not do when we are watching something we should always be in control so we are playing video games we should be in control we are doing the studies we should be in control parents will be happy so because doesn't matter how much you control you can still do the accidents accidents still happen even if you are on the best roads and even if you are on the safest car in the world, they can still happen. So what we need to do, we need to keep practicing, keep practicing and always be conscious and be aware. Okay, we got six minutes left. Do we want to do that? No. Do we yeah, we want to do Kirtan, Jay. Kirtan. Kirtan. Quiz. Okay, let's do, let's do both. Maybe we can do both. How? We have five minutes. Yeah, we can do that. A couple of minutes, Kirtan. Jay, would you please lead us into the trip? Can we do all three now? Yes. Yes. So which kitchen are we doing? What's, what's your favorite? If, if you like, you can uh, 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 Maha, Maha Mantra. Or... I do the hot tea today. Sorry, Adi, we didn't get you. I do the hot tea today. Today? Yes. You we did. To you want to do... I need the word spots. Okay, well, in that case, I will share this with you or your dad, and then you can practice, and tomorrow we can do. Tomorrow you can lead. Okay. Very nice. Okay, Jay, up to you. Whatever is your favorite. Go for it, please. Yes. Very nice. Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama, Hare Rama, 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 Rama,
Jai, thank you so much. I wish we, we... we have one last bit remaining. Could you please yes. somebody's phone? Yes, let's Let do it. Like, Abhi, uh, Abhi, Abhi, uh, oh, it's close, close. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, somebody's phone. Please, can you make somebody's phone? I really want to make it. Can I be host? No. Please. Can I be host? 12 o'clock. Can I be host? Please. No. no. Why? No. Okay, no. all right. Right. May may I request you not to stay for very long? Okay. Yeah. Because one hour you are there or you were there at the front of the screen anyways. So don't stay very long at the front of the screen, okay? Okay. okay. Sharma. We all have Prabhuji. Yes, Adi. And can you make somebody host? Host. No, host or something. Okay. <laughs> 